Speaking of working out, I want to do a time attack for. Hmm. I'm going to go. Oh. Let's let's do this. Three, two, one, go. I can improve my PB on this quite easily. I know I can. Let's go for another PB improvement tonight. So one thing, if anyone's wondering why, why Heppenwana, why you, you're going to be doing at the event love three levels. Why do you keep doing all the other levels? Well, on one hand, it keeps me relaxed. You know, and that way I don't get too bored of the levels. On the other hand, Fred Wood is going to be making a custom level for us, of which, knowing him, he's going to have a lot of challenges in it that might pull from older things. So, it might pull from his entire catalog of love obstacles and tribulations and trials. So, let's go ahead and get a little practice because I might not I know I will not beat Char Bunny. And that's not self depreciating or anything like that. Char Bunny just really good. But that custom level, ooh, I wanna try and win on that one. Cause I love being able to just roll with the punches on this game. So, you know, play the old levels, get used to their, you know, special breed. Because each game does have a unique feel to it. Love 3 definitely feels like the most polished one. Love 1 feels the least polished and the most chaotic. And then Love 2 is... Well, Love 2 for me just has a special place in my heart. Okay, let's stop doing that. I could sometimes get those. I'm not getting those today. <laughs> I've got just don't force things. Boy, I'm having a lot of trouble with that gap today. Boy, I really wish though my live split was working. I mean, at least this game does have a timer on it, so, you know, I have an idea of how I'm doing. But I want to know how I'm approaching on each level, especially on level 3. 1, 2, 3, boop, boop. A 1, 2, a boop, a boop. And then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. YOLO jumps. Not a YOLO jump. Slide through here. Oh yeah, so many boops. I have a dog that is adorable. I am a corgi fanatic and I have a real cute corgi. And let's just say, ooh, that was not the best way of starting this stage. And my lap is all about booping snoots. Like giving the little nose bops. All right. I'm just gonna sit here for a second. Drink some tea. Make sure that those are still dangerous and will still kill me. Just kind of take my time. The most dreaded speedrun obstacle in the world, the auto scroller. Nothing we could do about it except scroll so slowly. Although it's a good level for taking a break. Like, you know, it's not quite the midpoint of this level set. But it's 
close enough to midpoint. Keep it all possibility fresh in your mind rather than grinding one route. Yeah, it's if I do just like one level set over and over, by the way, let's get that collectible just because. If I do the same thing over and over, I eventually just, I lose my will to keep playing. Like I, I have a real short attention span. I've never been formally diagnosed with ADHD, but I, I'll just say I am probably ADHD because I cannot keep my attention span on anything. And yeah, I have to just keep swapping what, what level set I'm doing, what category I'm doing. Even when I have an event coming up where it's like, no, you are only doing this one category. It's why in some previous events I've had it where, um, I've had bid wars for what level set, like on this one, when I've submitted it to events before, I've asked for a possible incentive of, or bid war of, do I do Love 1 Classic or Love 1 Remastered? Which completely changes everything, especially this stage. This stage in Classic is a nightmare for me. In Remastered, well, that's what I'm doing right here. And you could see I'm mostly, mostly doing good. <laughs> Had a few more boops than I normally do. But this one is all about a, just having a good rhythm. And it's like, just go with the flow. On classic, those bullets move at a different speed than you. Ooh, that was sneaky. Hmm. Those bullets move at a different speed than you do. They move slower. So it makes it real tricky when you're running with them. Running against them is not too bad. Whoa, that's another cycle lost. That's wonky. Let's see if we could at least do the cycle skip right here. Did the cycle skip, okay. Let's see if we could do some good big jumps. Big jump. Big jumps. Oh boy, wow. That was sneaky. Well, might not be getting the new PB that I was aiming for, but still having a little bit of fun because Changing up what levels I'm doing always feels pretty fun. Also, some of these older level sets are just comforting for me because they're the levels that I did for so long. So it's nostalgic. Runner swag. And that's a new PB. Check that out. Nice. 83865. Yeah. Calzone Zone is really good, I'll just say. 